everybody, it's Honest John again. Now, I'm sure most, if not all of you, are familiar with the viral video that showed a sort of, kind of, confrontation between an elderly Native American and some young students wearing MAGA hats. Now, when I first saw the video, I didn't think there was anything to make a big fuss about. A lot of people jumped to conclusions about what was going on there. Since then, more videos and more information has come out, but it still does not make what was going on there crystal clear. For example, a fairly big deal has been made about a black sect called the Hebrew Israelites. Stupid name, which is fitting because it's a bunch of stupid people. At first, People were saying that they were abusing the white kids in the MAGA hats. And they were, but it turns out they were yelling nasty stuff at everybody. They even said that uh, the Native Americans had lost their lands because they weren't Christians. Which is a stupid thing to say. Being Christian has never prevented bad things from happening to anybody. Just ask the victims of the Inquisition. And don't forget... The same white Christians that stole the Indians' land also enslaved the ancestors of the black people who were yelling at, the, at that shit. But all of that stupidity aside, they were obviously not actually threatening anyone because we know what happens to black people in this country if they even appear to be a threat. And since they weren't arrested, obviously they weren't threatened. The Native American man says that he felt intimidated by the kids in the MAGA hats, but I didn't see those kids doing anything that looked particularly threatening. It is true that people who wear MAGA hats are racist and xenophobic, extremists, and likely to become violent, but the guy put himself there voluntarily, so I don't know how threatened he actually was. But since Donald Trump the man that, that those kids most admire is a compulsive liar. It is likely that they are lying about what they were doing during the incident. So exactly what went on at the Lincoln Memorial is not clear. But it doesn't seem like it merited the fuss that it generated. The only thing that I can say definitively is that the adults from the school who were chaperoning those kids and encouraged them to behave like they did and put them in that situation and probably even bought them their MAGA hats uh, were irresponsible idiots. Thanks for listening. Well, I want to thank you all for watching my videos. But there are certain changes that Google has made to YouTube which, since I'm a smaller channel, means that I can't monetize my videos. So I found places where I can. So instead of watching my videos here on YouTube, I'd appreciate it if you'd go either to Patreon or to uh, Top Buzz. Uh, they, they let me monetize videos and I don't even have to put commercials on. So. If you want to become a patron on Patreon, that's fine. If you don't, you can still watch the videos there. I've just kind of given up on YouTube. YouTube is just a place that I use so that I can put my videos in other places. So, Patreon, Top Buzz, the links are in the description box. Thanks a lot.